Tangerine TV! Hi everybody, it's me, Tangerine. Uh, this is just like a little bit of an update video. So I've been fully vegan for a week now and I've lost about six pounds. I'm, I mean, that's what the scale says. I don't really see anything different on my body. Um, just that my stomach doesn't hurt anymore when I eat food, so that's a plus. Um, so, as kind of a joke, I wanted to do what's in my fridge. It's like what's in my purse, but for fat people. And so, um, I'm going to show you what's inside my fridge. Okay, so this is not my fridge, but I thought I should show you. Um, every day for breakfast, uh, I eat fruit. Um, this is not all of it. Like, I need to go shopping and get some more. Um, I just got these halos, though. They looked pretty good. Um, but usually I'll have, um, like, three oranges, three bananas, or, like, three apples and three bananas. These ones aren't quite ripe yet, so I've just been eating a lot of oranges. There's a lot more than this. This is all that's left. Um, so fruit is what I usually eat for breakfast. I noticed I haven't, I thought I'd be cooking a lot more being fully vegan, but I just cook the same. I cook one big meal and then um, kind of split it out over the week. So anyway, to my fridge. This is a, it's a whirlpool. It's a little fridge because obviously I can see over it quite well. I'm not like raising the camera up. Um, it's just like a little fridge. It's, I don't know, mini size. It's not very big. This is a small apartment. But on top of my fridge, um, I have these mango chips. Uh, they're okay. They're pretty good. Um, and I do have oatmeal and cereal. I don't eat this stuff for breakfast. I actually sometimes will have this for dinner, usually, um, if I don't have anything already prepared. Um, I have some pasta, capellini. Uh, angel hair is my favorite kind. So probably this week I'll make some spaghetti. Um, just sandwich bags. Um, I switched my tea. I used to drink this uh, black Irish tea with uh, creamer. And so now what I've been doing is I've just been having uh, green tea for breakfast um, with raw cane sugar and it's not bad it still gives me that little cook a kick and then I have my uh, the sushi set I got forever ago and my friends keep trying to take it from me because I haven't opened it it's been like four years but now that I'm vegan I I could probably make some cool uh, vegan rolls it's got like everything in it to make the rolls like the, the little uh, straw roller thing and all the dishes and stuff and a uh, in a recipe book, so I probably should bust that open. Okay, now to the fridge. Um, this is the freezer. I have some random magnets that have old pictures in them, like this baby. Oops, and this baby are not babies anymore. They're like two. <laughs> so anyway, to the freezer. Uh, it's pretty simple. I, I bought these uh, soy cream sandwiches. They are... They're not bad, actually. Um, I, I kind of have to play mind games with myself. I keep, like, I have this pizza, and I don't eat this stuff all the time, even though this is vegan. But I, f I feel like if I have something like this in my freezer, when I get, like, an urge to eat something, I just know that I have something at home that, you know, I can make for myself. Uh, this is a vegan roast my mom got for me for Thanksgiving. I haven't cooked it yet. Um... These are, uh, like veggie burgers. They're like vegetable marsala burgers from Trader Joe's. They're pretty good. Um, I do have a rice cooker, <laughs> but I never use it. So I get these, um, jasmine rice packets and they steam in the microwave. And it just makes rice cooking so much easier. I have jasmine rice and then I also have a brown rice one. And then these are just, uh, I try not to eat these, but I keep them in the freezer just in case I don't have vegetables. Um, and they're, they're all steamers, so I, if I'm super lazy and don't feel like cooking at all, I can just throw them in the microwave. Uh, this fruit <laughs> probably needs to get thrown away. And then this is, um, peppers. They're more, I've more used this for, like, a soup to add some flavor. So moving down to the refrigerator part. Ah, my fridge. <laughs> it looks kind of bare. Uh, I'll start from the bottom. How about that? Uh, these were some vegan uh, chickenless chicken fingers that I made yesterday. And I was going to take them to work with me this morning, but I forgot. So I have those. I'll probably eat those. 
maybe tomorrow. Um, and here is just some beans that I had made uh, the other day, um, and I had a, I made a burritos for myself, vegan burritos. Um, some soyaki sauce. I used that in this. I made. I can't even see it. It's just it's just rice and uh, broccoli, uh, steamed broccoli in the soyaki sauce. And um, I haven't. I don't drink regular milk. I never really was a fan of milk. Um, but this last year, I recently switched to almond milk because I used to drink soy milk all the time. And everybody says that's bad for you because of hormones and stuff. So last year, I switched to almond milk, and I really like it. I also keep um, chocolate milk in here because if I ever do feel like a, a sweet tooth chocolatey urge, I usually drink like half a cup, a cup of this, and it it handles my urges and gives me that chocolatey sweet flavor. Um, this is what I used instead of cheese in my burritos was this um, spicy guacamole to kind of give it that creamy flavor. Vegan, of course. Some pico de gallo. And this is the green salsa that I put in my beans. I like my beans to be kind of soupy. Um, I have some vegetables. I'm going to make, I'm going to steam these tomorrow. Um, <laughs> I have like no tubware. This is vegan mac and cheese. And if you expect vegan mac and cheese to taste like regular mac and cheese, it doesn't at all. It, I don't even know what it tastes like. It's okay. Um, up here I have some strawberry preserves and sunflower butter. Sunflower butter, oh, this stuff is so good. It's so much better than regular peanut butter, but you have to keep it in the fridge once you open it. I have some uh, jarred mangoes. I'll probably eat those maybe like this weekend or something. And there's just the baking soda to keep the refrigerator fresh. Um, I have normal uh, condiments. Um, I'm trying to move away from the soy, so I have this Bragg's, which to me tastes like soy sauce. Ketchup, teriyaki sauce. I don't think these two are vegan. I probably need to get rid of those. And then I just have I have some Cristal uh, hot sauce, pickles, mustard, and some more Cristal. And that's about it for what's in my fridge. <laughs> Thank you for watching, everybody. Bye.